Hi everyone, I am back with another video. Um, I have filmed this video a few times today, just getting frustrated with interruptions. But I told myself, get some coconut water, because I love coconut water. And film the video. So that's what I'm going to do. So I got a new planner. And oh, and I'm so proud of myself, guys. I figured out how to film with the, there we go, with the um, tripod this time. So this is my uh, pocket Motrum and the pink pebble. Um, and I think it's also the Lux. So I um, got on the bandwagon. I saw versions of this, uh, of the Motrum planner. And I thought it was really beautiful. Um, I really wanted like a croco, like a croc um, design, but I like the Versa um, layout, and I those two don't you know, don't come together for some reason. So I decided just to get this one, and this is a, a pink pebble. So the first thing I want to say is that I did change out the rings. So I have the thirty millimeter. Um, I got the planner from the Mochum website, but the the rings, I got them from Amazon. They cost about nine bucks and I got two rings. So uh, just for reference, this one is the smaller ring and then this one is the, the 30 millimeter rings. So it does make uh, quite a difference. The planner came with these inserts. I'm not sure if I'm going to use them. But I just keep them in the in the box that the planner came in, which is this really nice um, black box. So without further ado, let's open up the planner. Oh, and I did get this little clip that attaches. It was only like eight bucks or something. I thought it looked cute, and I was right. So I do want to say I am also filming in my office and not in my usual preferred spot on my bed. I do plan to do a plan like a office tour when the office is ready. I'm still getting things ready and everything like that. So let's get into the planner. So this is the newer version, I think, of the Versa because all the other ones that I've seen have the little flap, but I actually like this setup better. So you get quite a few car slots on this side. And um, I got this from this in case of emergency. Actually, let me zoom in a little bit. I got that in case of emergency card from the planner spot. And uh, these two as well, these goals. I have some transparent, transparent sticky notes, the two by two raindrops in nude from Point and Hun. And then also she was having some oops sales on her plastic journaling cards, I guess. And I got this one, so I just put it there in the back. In the side pocket, it comes with a nice side pocket. I have some stickers in here. Most of them are from, well, all of them are from the uh, planner spot. And I also have this little food list. It says what I have and what I need from paper in. This is a uh, my grocery my grocery list. I rather go to the grocery store a few times a month than to waste food because we don't do that here. Then in the zip pocket, I have some stickers that I use for my monthly. So I have some from Planner Kate, Planner Kate. These are Honey Ink Work stickers. These stickers are from Grace, uh, Grace, Brooklyn Grace Co. Uh, some more from Your Everyday Planner, Tyron Plans, and more Honey Inked. So those are the icons that I use on the monthly views. On the other side of the planner, I have some more stickers here these are from the planner spot studio five on Etsy planning for six more Tyron designs on Etsy so those are what I keep in the pockets 
In the back pocket, I keep some receipts and the, it's very nice and big, and the Planet Fitness monthly schedule. I feel bad I haven't been to the gym yet this year and I got a gym membership last year, but that's okay. So onto the planner flip through. So on this, it does bring a fly leaf and I'm really happy because if it's my favorite pen, the Pilot Friction and with the four colors. Then I also have this journey card from the planner spot. This is from Venus Planner Co. And then I cut this cloth and paper. I could have just put it there, but I cut cloth and paper sticky notes to fit in that pocket. And I just put it all with the rose gold clip that I got. I got like a bunch of them from AliExpress. I don't have anything in these pockets. Um, I still have, so my setup is a little bit different. Uh, I still have some inserts that I actually bought today that I need to cut and put in. I got a series tracker and a savings tracker from Penis Planet Co. Uh, but the, the, from the video that I did last time, I didn't like that video because it was very wobbly. Uh, so I'm just going to zoom in just a little bit more because the last, uh, there we go. Okay, so this is what I have. Um, I have this little journey card that I got from Cloth and Paper. Then on the inside, I have a, this other journaling card. Let me just center it here. That says, let me see, let me see. There we go. That says, see the beauty and everything and begin with yourself. On this side, uh, this is where my monthly starts. I just decorate the, you know, the first page. So my monthly, or sorry, the year at a glance is next. And I went and highlighted all the holidays. In addition, it came with the uh, holidays and observances. Um, this is an insert from Penis Planner Co. And I just decided to put just little nice and, you know, memorable things that happened in this year. So, yeah. Then it goes into the calendar view. The over overview. So, you have your goals, your important dates, and the bill due. And then you have this nice little to-do list. Um, on top, I have, to mark the date, I have this planner routine. This is another journal card from Point and Han. It's quite flimsy. And um, I wouldn't recommend hole punching it. I would recommend using the, the, um, what are, what are those things called? These things from Erin Condren to stabilize them. But this is my monthly view. These stickers are from the, the planner spot. When she had her Black Friday sale, I went and I bought the, um, the sheet so I like the deco the deco and then these little icons are very good for the monthly and I could even use the washing and everything in my planner I also um, use little these are the little circles from Kate planner Kate sorry to mark when I'm working I also have the honey inked one here little things for Bill I did not go to the gym today but I wasn't feeling it and then I put some washi tape here. So I have um, all 12 months. And as you can see, I started pre-planning. I do really like the 30 millimeter rings. I think if you're gonna have a planner this affordable and this beautiful and with the option, oh, sorry, with the option of having the um, rings switched out, I think it's a great idea to do it. Also, this was in my um, A5. And uh, this just marks, I'm going to zoom out just a little bit, actually. This marks the, um, there we go. This marks, it's like a, a fold out from Peanuts Planner Co. It's the tri-fold. And on this, I just put memorable events. Um, this is for archive purposes. So then my next is my, this, insert I found on 
online. If I don't st if I don't know where it's from, it's I either got it from online or from Pinterest. So this has my 22 goals, and then this is a future dates insert from Peanuts Planner Co. I really love this insert. I think I have like four of them throughout this planner. Then that paper that I love from the planner spot, inbox sticker from cloth and paper. This didn't work for me, so I found this online, and I really like it. I also found another format, but I, I know I like this one better. Um, but if, if you use printables and you know that cutting and printing is takes time so you're so I'm gonna use these um, I'm gonna use them so then I also have these black upper dividers so I have side tabs um, upper divider page markers page flags and then I also have like sticky notes so that's how I can find and also these little plate page flags from club and paper that's how I'm able to find things uh, within my planner so my next section is my uh, weekly my weekly uh, inserts, which I found online. So I have this journaling card. I don't remember where I got this from. I think it was cloth and paper, but usually she has like her handle there on the bottom. So I'm not sure where it's from, but I really liked it. Then I have this memo from cloth and paper. Oops, sorry. And then this, um, this is from Erin Condren. I got it during the sale, but I don't remember. See how I, I, there it is. It's just this one. So, sorry, I touched my hair. So, yeah, so I have this cute little sticker of this girl. It looks like me. And then, um, oh, this is my, the first weekly that I did. And then th these are, these weeklies I found online. I use these stickers from Daisy and Divine for the day off and then I have my to do to mark what week I'm on I did not go to the gym today because I just wasn't feeling it and but I think I could still do some yoga after this video so we'll just mark that off and then I have just a couple weeks on here so I use my favorite paper is a 28 pound paper but I also because I was in that Filofax pocket croc I also use regular just printing paper and I was able to fit a lot in here and I still have room for more. So this is my next divider. It's my home routine. This cute little sticker that I found. Um, it comes like in a little bundle like this on Amazon. I don't remember what it's called because I threw the, the packaging away but I have quite, quite a lot. It was a good price. Uh, so this is my cleaning routine. So you know, if you buy a house, you have to clean it all the time. So I just wrote down one to two things that I have to do every day, except for, excuse me, except for Sunday, because usually I have Sunday off. These are my top tabs. They're from AliExpress. They came like this in four colors. So onward, I have just the same thing printed on the, or written on the back I found this insert online it's a habit tracker and I have it up until um oops, let me just go back one up until September so I really sorry oh why is it doing that there we go sorry up until September then I also have this insert from penis planner co so I did jump on this bandwagon because also because I didn't I couldn't figure out how to use this so I use this as a period tracker so I put like how heavy and if it was painful so I have a few inserts of that and then I just have a month or yeah the month overview to see how long it, it went for so I can keep track I have a movie log here from penis planner co these two are from penis planner co and then I just bought a series tracker which i'm gonna print after i make this video so yeah and i just watched um disney's encanto and i really liked it so yeah then i have a service log sorry let's let's get sharp there we go the service log where i put what needs to be maintenance in my house or my car then i have my next section which is like my notes section 
So I realize I'm not a grid or dot or graph type of girl. I just like plain boxes. So I found these on Pinterest and they were free printables. If I found it online, it was free. I also have this contact page from Penis Pinnacle, just in case, you know, things happen. I have this resource to just remind me of, you know, little things. This is a little page, page flag from Cloth and Paper. They're actually called Spotlight Page Flags. And that's what they look like. So I have them throughout the planner. I also have a password insert. And my next section is my work section. This is from that same um, online Amazon sticker that I found, packet that I found. So you can go to your H, your local HR or just uh, if you're where you work on the website, like, a, like employee portal website, you can find the payroll schedule and pay paydays. So that's what I did. And I just highlighted the, the months that we get paid more than um more than two more than two times so then i have this marker from point and hun see this i put this one on the Erin condren and it's a lot sturdier than when i tried to hole punch it so going on actually i think it's a little bit further down all right so moving on i do have the holidays on this section that my job recognizes and then this is another insert from penis planner co where the same insert with the months so that i can write stuff that happens at work um let me just see then i have a resource page for things that, um from from work i also have this insert from penis planner co where i track the paid time off at work because we cap out at a certain number so I want to make sure I'm taking vacation. This next section is like my home section. These are my words, self-love and strength. And of course, I always, my baby's name there, um, what I want to focus on in 2022. This is an appointment tracker for me. The pink is me and this green one in the back is for my son. So I have appointment tracker, a health log, just, you know, see how I feel if I feel sick. Then I have a mood tracker for myself, a medicine log. And um, I use these page circles from Cloth and Paper, circle page flag set, this one, to, for more, you know, to help me find things faster. And then I also have this one from cloth and paper it's just needs to be replaced but it's okay this square flags one and this black color i really love that one it's one of my favorites uh, so i have so much cloth and paper i don't need any more so then i just have a couple of the mood trackers in here and then this today insert from peanuts planner co is uh has my medications and vitamins and all this stuff that I take so if I go to doctors and they ask me what I take then I know what it is and then doctors vis vis visit sorry and then for my son it's basically the same same thing um, then my next insert so this is what I'm trying to quit this year and I found this expense tracker online oops sorry it's not it's not focusing this expense tracker online and uh, uh, all the pink is the bad things that I did. So I just have a couple of those. I really like this, it's very spacious. Sometimes the, the penis planner coat are just a little bit too small for me. So this is a principle from Principal Kate. It actually looks like this, but I wanted to write down like all of my bills, like all of them. Some of them do you know, need to be paid off. But this is the page where I have all my bills listed. Then I have a actual bill tracker from Penis Planner Co. So I have a couple pages of those. Then I have, this is a insert from Peanuts Planner Co. And I write down my, how much I get paid so that I can see how much is fluctuating. 
I put this sticker at the top here. And this is the, I bought the Petite Planner Budget Book from Erin Condren during their Black Friday. I really did take advantage of Black Friday. Like I got a lot of things on Black Friday. And this is another of those future dates insert. So this is my financial section. I don't like this section. I'll show you. This is from Penis Planner Co. I'm not a fan of this. I don't know. I feel like it's, I don't know. So I ordered the Last Call Financial Bundle from Cloth and Paper to see if I like that better. The only downside is, downsize is that it probably won't be available or if she reformats it, then I'll have to try it. Then I have these payment trackers. I have a few of those in there. Then I have this acetate from the Platter Spot. I got this like a few, this is from a long time ago, like years. Then next is my reoccurring task. This is an insert from Penis Planner Co. I just, you know, do a little check mark if I've done it once the month, once during the month, that's good enough. Because like I said, you know, having to clean a whole house is very, very hard. Then I have this uh, task manager insert. This is also from Peanuts Planner Co. I'm um, sorry, trying to get the camera to, there we go, to focus. This section, this next section is my wish list. This cover is from Peanuts Planner Co. off her Facebook I believe that's where I got it so I have I don't write on this page because I like the cover but these are like my long-term wish list like things I want to fix or buy and then I have things that I want here so I did buy some just saying printables and I'll show you those in a moment again another future date insert and this is for like big per big purchases like things I have to save up for so then my next divider is my so this year I plan to work out even though we're 12 days in still got time and eat healthier I have been eating eating healthier which is a good thing so I got these inserts from just on your principles they were a little bit difficult to print but they were worth it. it took a couple tries so this is what it looks like so this is what oh I did eat Ooh, I didn't eat lunch. I ate trail mix because I wasn't that hungry. And then I have, I had fish, the mahi mahi with uh, veggies for dinner. So I'm going to write that down. So this is what it looks like. This is today. I had two eggs and trail mix for most of the day. And then I have this fitness. She also has a fitness insert. Down here I marked the pages when I'm printing so that I can just refill it because this was very difficult to print kind of for me. Uh, it took a few tries because I wanted the front cover and it was, it was kind of hard, but I got it. So here I plan to write down how much um, exercise I'm doing, like how much you know just write down the workouts and stuff so I have a few pages of those these are printed on just regular printing paper and then um, I have this I've had this oh the weight loss the weight log this is from peanuts planner co as well so because I just want to track how much weight I'm, I'm gonna lose then I have I added this pen loop I do have one here. You do get one right here. Like you can put a pen in there. But um, it kind of gets weird when you're trying to close the planner. So it has to be like a really skinny pen. Like one of these, you know, or like just, just something really skinny. But so I didn't put anything there. Um, so I have my, my gray mile liner here. Then I had... I pretty I had this in my, like my first pocket planner, so I just put it in here because I liked it. it. Has a little pocket here that I cut myself. This I got from cloth and paper. Yeah, from cloth and paper. 
Then on the back is a picture of my son. And this is a page lifter. So yeah, that is my pocket Versa from Motrum. I do highly recommend this planner. Um, it's really beautiful and this is like the pebbled format. I didn't think I would like it because I'm a big Croco fan, but I, I use this every day and it's very, it's worth it to buy, to upgrade the rings. So I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a great start to the new year and um, let me know what you think about my planner. Thank you. Have a great one.